Vagal maneuvers have been used for many years with patients in stable supraventricular tachycardias, and we've recently seen the emergence of the modified vagal maneuver, which further exploits the overshoot of blood pressure when strain is released at the end of the vagal maneuver by laying the patient down and rapidly raising their legs. This enhances activation of baroreceptors, which tends to decrease heart rate and often leads to termination of the SVT. Let's take a look. So how this works is I'm going to get you to blow into this syringe for 10 seconds. And when we reach the 10 seconds, you, we're going to take you on a little bit of a ride. We're going to lay you down and my partner's going to lift your legs up. All right. Does that sound like something you can do? That's Any questions? Fantastic. All right. Okay. I'm going to hold your legs, John. I'm just going to take this off for a moment. Okay. And I'm going to count to 10 now. You put your lips around it. Just print. All right, good. All right, and blow, 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 blow. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So blow, looking at blow, the monitor, blow. and we don't have a change. Okay. At this point, you should have a change. All right, we'll put you back in that same position. Good job, John. Did great. I'm afraid that didn't work. So.